the Valley's very fortunate. A Salt River project was part of the original development of the water supplies for the Valley. Before Arizona was a state, Salt River Project was formed to build Roosevelt Dam. That enabled us to take the river that supplied water in very wet years and store it so it could be used in dry years. That allowed agriculture to bloom in the desert. As those lands urbanized, that water supply became the basis of an urban supply that supported growth in the valley. SRP manages a 13,000 square mile watershed that's located in the forests of Arizona where snow collects into rivers and streams, comes down into our reservoirs. We store that water and deliver it to the valley through 131 miles of canals. Now that water is delivered to water treatment plants. It's treated to drinking water standards and delivered to residents. Other parts of the valley have access to Colorado River water delivered to them by the Central Arizona Project Canal. And those supplies together form a dependable supply that is resilient. In times when there's not enough surface water, we supplement that with groundwater from wells. And that gives us a dependable supply that helps us withstand what happens during droughts. We've been in a drought for over two decades, but it's important to remember that drought is a meteorological climate condition. It's something we prepare for, something that we adapt to. And so when we think about drought, we have to remember the parts that we can control. We can be prepared by advanced planning to make sure that we have necessary supplies and backups. And those things that we invest in keep us from having a shortage. As we've done in the past, storage is really the key factor in preparing for periods of drought. One of those ways is at Roosevelt Lake. Roosevelt Lake has additional storage capacity in what's called flood control space. We'll actually increase the ability to store water in wet times so that water is available to us in dry times. Water is complicated. SRP is very fortunate to have great relationships with city partners, other parts of government, as well as private water companies. And we have been working closely with them on projects that will prepare us for the future. These partnerships allow us to maximize the benefit. So we're not just acting on behalf of SRP, we are acting as a region to solve these problems together.